Welcome to the Mechanic Desk Help Videos. In this tutorial, we will go over the creation of a new employee and the differences between roles slash access levels. Once you have logged into Mechanic Desk, navigate to the Settings tab and then the Employees tab. This is your employee list, which shows the employee, the username, and the access level. To create a new employee, select the New Employee button to view the Employee Creation page. On the left of the screen is the employee details where you can enter their name, date of birth, email, and phone. Below this section, you can add the salary or cost to the employee as well as the charge out rate. To the right of the page, you can enter the login details for the employee. It's important to enter a username, email address and password or the employee will be unable to log in. Beneath this you will notice the Role or Access Level section. There are five levels of access. Admin, Staff, Senior Mechanic, Mechanic and Restricted Mechanic. Admins have access to everything within Mechanic Desk. Staff have access to almost everything, but within Settings, for example, they can only view personal details and integrations, not workshop details, chart of accounts, or data export slash import. Senior Mechanics do not have access to Settings reports or invoices and bills. Mechanics do not have access to customers and vehicles, invoices and bills, service schedules, reports or point of sale. Restricted mechanics are similar to mechanics but they can only see the part number slash name on the invoice. They do not actually see the pricing of the parts. They also cannot make purchase orders. There are multiple other restrictions you can enable outside of these roles. If you have any questions about these, please don't hesitate to contact the Mechanic Desk support team. 